Yo, yo, yo. I said, and wait, let me pause. Okay, this is a message because I see I see comments like this every now and then. It's not even frequently, but it's every now and then. If you do not like a YouTuber's intro, guess what you need to do? Click off of the video and leave. You know what I'm saying? Like at the end of the day, anybody that does YouTube, there's a million different intros out there. So you, you guys see how my intro is, it's different. I got the first intro, then I got the, the, uh, the daily quote, then I got my intro to start the video off. If you don't like it, do not watch. It's very, very simple. So I don't know what is wrong with some of these bots out here. But anyways, yo, yo, yo. I say yo. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Jaren. coming to you guys with another video. Man, if you guys are new to the channel, you already know what to do. Drop a like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And if anybody's interested in MMA, UFC, or fighting in general, be sure to subscribe to my MMA channel. The link is down below in the description. So let's get into today's video, guys. So, as you guys know, currently right now, everybody's playing Proving Grounds. If you played Faction Wars already, you know, you know what's going on over there. I can't get into too much detail. Check out my most, you know, check out my video that's on the home, the home screen. But, if I go into the Proving Grounds matches, uh, I wanted to go to a match that a lot of people tend to have trouble with, rightfully so. And it'll only get worse with the six-man ladder match and stuff like that. But ladder matches guys i wanted to go to ladder matches and i wanted to pick legendary difficulty and basically guys i wanted to show you guys um how you're supposed to win these ladder matches in a timely fashion now i'm just going to be breaking it down to you because i know that a lot of people do not like ladder matches so i definitely want to make sure that i'm dropping videos like this so i can help you guys out uh win these matches in a better fashion so obviously guys a ladder match is pretty self-explanatory you have to grab the ladder and um go up to the top of the um you know go up to the top climb 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 and then grab the object now if you guys don't understand how this works basically um there's about six bars in a circle that you know load up when you're trying to go for the briefcase and um basically what's going to happen is no matter who's going for the briefcase those bars are going to stay the same so right here even if you just let the ai just go for it like you see how i'm just standing right here if you let him just go for the uh you know for the object he will do just that and you, you have to let it load up obviously um let it load up into the very last one so he'll miss a few times but it's about what five of them let him load up to the third one right here and then from there guys you want to push him off and basically slam him down you could do it to the fourth one but sometimes it gets a little bit iffy um in terms of like okay like if i let him get to the fourth one and you don't push the ladder down in time and he's quickly you know sometimes the ais will actually quickly get it to the next bar so you know you could just do it to three just to be safe um, and then from there guys, obviously you want to sit there and you know, build up your M, you know, your, your my fashion points. And, um, when you go up there guys, the same exact three bars will be fully selected. So when you go up there, look, for example, if you have a card that's thing like a B, right, which is one of the better cards to use, you can utilize that to your full extent. Once I go up here and climb the ladder, um, I'll be in a situation where I'm only going to have just about two of them left. So once I reach for it right here, you see, I'm going to go, it's, it's like a small bar. So you have to be precise at that point, guys, but you know what I'm saying? It'll be up to you to get, you know, beat the AI up. Obviously, right now it's too early in the match for me to even try to get the ladder or get the briefcase because I only have 15 out of 90 my fashion points. So when you first allow the AI to just build up all of its my fashion points um, or, you know, to build up the meter on the on the briefcase, then you want to build your my fashion points up, um, get it to 90, and then you can go for the finish where you can just easily, easily get the last bits the briefcase so that's what i'm gonna do for you guys i'm gonna actually finish getting the my fashion points to show you guys you know the authenticity of this and then as soon as i get the my fashion points then i'll go start to make the move to get the briefcase all right so we just just got the 90 my fashion points stunned them on the ground right there i'm gonna put the ladder down remember guys it's been two about two bars on the um on the briefcase left to grab and um i can just climb right up the ladder right here get that one in there get that last one in there guys so it's that simple for the one-on-one -on -one ladder matches guys don't make it more difficult than it is don't panic when the ai is actually going for the briefcase actually allow the ai to you know get the briefcase to three i would say you could even do four um if you could time it but i'm only saying three just because i know some people might sit there do four and then the ai just grabs the last one on you know the fifth one now someone's upset and frustrated and oh my god i tried you know what i mean so i'm just making sure it's, I'm, I'm being i'm doing it from a safe route but me personally guys I'm gonna do four. I'm just gonna I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I'm gonna get it to four. So when I'm going up to the climb the ladder after I get the 90 my fashion points, I'm just trying to put one bar in there and then just be done. So guys, 
if y'all enjoyed this video me breaking down to you guys how to simply win ladder matches and guys also this also applies to six man matches and when you know when it gets really crazy especially when it gets really crazy the only thing you want to do is make sure you're preventing them from actually getting that final bar but don't panic when you see that the ais are going for the briefcase they're gonna do that allow them to go to, for the briefcase and then you know play up you know play off of it just like that don't don't panic just simply be calm cool calm collected you're already on legendary difficulty you're already gonna have to deal with getting reversed a million times in a row so there's no reason to be panicking when you see them going for the you know for the uh briefcase allow them to do it and then kick them off at just about you know three bars or if, if you're feeling risky like me then you could do four so guys it's very simple if you guys want to see more videos like this where i break it down to you guys exactly how to win certain matches in proven grounds um what's difficult things of that nature make sure you guys leave a like comment subscribe hit the notification bell guys and make sure you're commenting down below what matches are you guys having difficulties with throughout proving grounds obviously guys i'm not trying to buzz all through proving grounds right now um unless i'm streaming for you guys which is the only you know what i mean the only time i'm going to be playing this game guys is while i'm streaming for you guys so if you guys want to make sure you know if you guys want to tune into the streams just simply subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you guys can be notified whenever i stream a lot of you guys will be end up seeing you know you will end up seeing me doing these um methods live on stream so it'll be easier that way also instead of having to wait for a video to come out so yeah guys drop the comments down below in terms of what videos you guys want to see from in, you know in wwe and what matches are you guys having difficulties with and um yeah i'll catch y'all boys in the next video man it's your boy john ranks and i'm out y'all peace Gang, they cannot do it like him. Uh, uh huh. Nobody shooting like him. Gang, nobody doing like him. That nigga hate everyone cause he broke. And that's why nobody like him. Gang, SD Glow, now he talking this shit.